Once upon a time you dressed so fine You threw a bump down in your prime Didn't you? Hey, I am getting rid of my hockey cards. Yep, it is time. I have assembled them into stacks that say take me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave them places and hopefully someone will see that and go, I can have that, yeah. And uh, I organize them in a way so that each stack is um, worth picking up. There's some old ones, some new ones, some good players in every stack. Um, there's about a hundred of them too. And um, I'm going to leave them places where hopefully hockey fans will find them. I'm not going to do it all at once, just gradually. When I go play hockey at the outdoor rink, I might leave a stack on the bench, something like that. I uh, really enjoyed collecting cards as a child. Um, we used to play street hockey on my cul-de-sac. I had five other friends on that street, and we'd play hockey, and also we'd bring out our cards and trade them, and it was a good time. Um, so I have one more stack to put together, and just to show you a couple of them. This is a Theo Fleury card. See, he's coming in on Tom Barrasso of the Penguins. It's the net cam view. I always really like this card. I thought it's a cool action shot. And then this is a really cool card. It's Marion Hossa on the Senators, and it's got a piece of his jersey on it. So that's an example of the kind of good cards that are in here. So um, happy hunting. You may or may not find one, as there's only 100, and I just live in the south part of Calgary. But um, yeah, if you do find one, enjoy. And um, also, I have a friend out in Vancouver who does a pretty cool podcast, and I'd like to mention him. Uh, Pucks on Net is their website, so I'll put a link to it. And uh, check him out. It's kind of a different kind of hockey talk, and it's pretty entertaining. Complete